how to start developing a business mindset and get results fast. My name is Kath Kyle and I help passionate business owners to create passive profits online. So how do we develop a business mindset? What does a business mindset look like? Now I had, before I really got serious about my first business, I had dabbled in the online world on and off and I don't know whether you have done the same thing but I had tried you know selling on eBay and then I'd done a bit of like online surveys and then you know kind of googled how do I you know make money from home and and looked into uh, jobs that would allow me to stay home and all these kind of things I had dabbled in, looked into, but I'd never really become an expert. I'd never really stuck to anything and that was my problem before I got really serious. So for me, what, what really changed was when I read the book Think and Grow Rich, it really helped me to develop a goal and a long-term business plan. And because I read this business plan night and day, it really solidified in my mind that I was serious about this, that I was no longer just dabbling in the online world that this was a, a serious business for me and this is the point where everything really changed for me I became really really consistent about working on my business every single day and for me the difference was that I started taking myself and my business seriously because I did no longer I, I no longer treated it like a hobby like something that I was going to fail at straight away it was something I was intending to be very successful in and I treated it like a job I treated it like something that you have to turn up for because if you don't, you're not going to be successful, you're going to get fired. And I treated my, my business in exactly the same way. And I didn't use it to put pressure on myself, but it did really help me to think, you know, this is my what I do for a living now, so I need to be consistent about it. So how can you start to develop a business mindset for success? Here are my five top tips for success. So number one is, to improve your confidence because a lot of people start businesses and they say you know I've got a business but it's you know I'm not really getting any customers I'm not really making very much money and a lot of the problem or most of the problem is their own confidence they don't really believe that they can do it so it's really really important to go through use some techniques that you can use to really improve your confidence when it comes to your business and things that you can do to improve your confidence are to visualize your success to say affirmations and really believe them you know say affirmations about your confidence about your success every single day and it really does work it really does improve your confidence and number two um, I would suggest when you're first starting with an online business is be very selective about who you tell about your business so most people won't take you seriously and the, you know I've, I've experienced this myself when I started my business I don't think anybody actually took me seriously because I wasn't making any money so as far as they were concerned it was a hobby you know it was just oh just another thing that, that Catherine's doing to dabble in online business so I had to be very selective I learned to be very selective about who I told that I had a business because you don't really feel very confident if you're not making money and you're kind of telling everyone oh I've got this this business and then people are saying oh is it doing well and you say no I haven't got any customers that's going to knock your confidence so I would say be very very selective I would join some mastermind groups and join with other people who are serious about business and then their success is going to rub off on you and they will take you seriously because you've made that commitment to go to that group and they know that you're working on your business every day number three do some goal setting, set your goals for your business and do this in a way that you can't let yourself off the hook. So I recommend setting 90 day goals, 30 day goals and daily goals. So every single day you should have a goal. What are you working on on your business? And you should have something that is moving your business to the next level every single day. If you don't do this, then you have not got the right mindset for uh, starting an online business you really need to be working on it every single day the fourth thing you can do for develop, developing a big business mindset is to become bigger than your problems because every business will have 
things that don't go perfectly there will always be problems or if you want to turn it on its head you can see those problems as challenges and I recommend that you, t you change the word problem into the word challenge and if you see everything as a challenge that we have to um, overcome this challenge and figure out how to how to get around this challenge you'll feel so much better because you're always working on a solution rather than moaning about the problem all the time so this is essential when you've got your own business is you do have you, you have constant challenges it's just a constant challenge in fact life is a constant challenge as far as I'm concerned but it's the way that you phrase it you know always be improving always be overcoming the the last the last challenge and facing the new challenge and this will help you to grow as a person and then you can enjoy the process instead of seeing it as a daily grind and a daily life full of problems and finally in your business focus on the 20% of the activities that you can do that yield the 80% of the results that are going to occur in your business so what one thing can you do today that is going to propel your business to the next level? And then what one thing you're going to do tomorrow? Is it the same thing? Is it creating a daily video? Is it creating a sales page for your business? Whatever it is, there are some tasks that are important and some tasks that are not so important. So like chatting on social media is not important when it comes to starting an online business, but creating a sales page is very important. That is the crucial step that you need to do. So you need to determine which of the tasks are very, very crucial to your success and just do those first. And then once you've done those, then give yourself a little break and go and have a chat on social media for five minutes and then get back to it and do the next um, big, big action. So taking action, you must take action in your business. So if you've got the right mindset, then you will be taking action every single day towards your success. So just to recap, here are the five tips to improving your business mindset. So number one, improve your confidence with visualization and affirmations. Number two, go to business mastermind groups and be selective with who you share your business with. Number three, set goals, set daily goals, monthly goals and three month goals for your business. Step four, see problems as challenges that you are going to enjoy overcoming. And step five, focus on the big actions that you can take today that are really going to propel your business to the next level. So here's a question for you. What are you going to do today that really can improve your business mindset? Let me know in the comments. I read everyone and I can't wait to hear from you. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, then please subscribe to my YouTube channel, Kath Kyle, for daily videos just like this one. And please like this video and share it so that you can help others and leave me a comment because I would love to hear from you. And I'd also love to know what are your questions so that I can create a video to help you answer your specific question. And if you'd like a free strategy call, then let me know and we can arrange that. Have a wonderful and productive day. See you tomorrow. Bye.